welcome back to Good Day Atlanta. It's 9-12 and mornings can be pretty hectic, but it is possible to whip up something that will fill you up and give you just what you need to start your day. We have Tammy Stokes with Cafe West Express here with a breakfast smoothie recipe that you can make and take on the go. Tammy, good morning. Good morning. Glad Thank you're you. here with us. Yes. Oh, this is perfect because it always seems like in the morning you're rushed to do everything and it can be hard to get a good breakfast in. A healthy breakfast. Healthy breakfast. Healthy right. and how about fast? Fast yeah. is key. <laughs> fast is fast, very important. Right? Okay, before we start putting it all together, let's talk about some smoothie secrets because there are some things you can do that are taking the nutritional value out of smoothies. <laughs> right. Some common, well, I guess, mistakes that a lot of us make. Okay, so high calorie would be one, right? Because mm -hmm. we, we want to do something healthy, but we certainly don't want to load our bodies with a bunch of extra calories. The other thing is sugar. Yeah. So we have to really watch the sugar content. Um, the secrets now to making healthy, delicious, low calorie smoothies are using one, water as the base, which is what we're gonna make in just a second here. So you can use water, or if you're using a plant milk, mm -hmm. like a nut milk or a coconut milk, you wanna cut that in half with water. So use half of whatever the recipe calls for, okay. half of the plant milk and half water. You probably can't even do. tell the difference, I imagine, cutting it in half. No, it still yeah. give you a nice little creamy texture you're uh -huh. looking for. Still tastes so good. one water, or to cut the plant milk in half, because plant milks tend to be mm -hmm. higher in fat and higher in calories. So no juice. <laughs> and then <laughs> that's watch, what you're saying, right? The, right, no yeah. juice bases, because that's all sugar. And then you want to watch the tropical fruits. Mm -hmm. So mangoes, pineapples, yeah. bananas, that make those creamy, delicious smoothies, very, very high in sugar. Okay. So that's where we have to watch. But this one is one you can make for 130 calories, whip wow. a bunch of stuff in the blender, put a bunch of soup foods in there and it tastes fabulous. Great. Okay, yes. walk us through it. What do we okay. need for this? So a cup of water cup as a base. Water going. Mm -hmm. All right. Or you can use your plant milk, right? And you cut it in half, half a, cu half a cup of plant milk, half a cup of water, mm -hmm. quarter cup of frozen cherries. Ooh, I like. That's going to be good mm -hmm. in there. That's going to be good because that's just enough sweetness. That's all you need. No sugar added to the fruits. Quarter cup of raspberries. Mm -hmm. Okay, half a cup of blueberries. Blueberries full of nice. antioxidants. Now you've got all these color combinations. You've got the reds, the blues, a little hemp seeds, a tablespoon of that for hemp your protein. Seeds. Okay. Yeah. Then a teaspoon of cinnamon, ground cinnamon. Mm -hmm. That's going to reduce the sugar impact too. Quarter teaspoon ginger, a little bit of turmeric nice. for some superfoods and anti inflammatories. And a little oh, secret, good. black pepper to help you absorb that turmeric, and that's it. Oh. Put it on. Who would have thought? Blend black it up. Black pepper in your smoothie. <laughs> and then you got Get it going. Like okay, this. and I, I'm gonna give this a try. Do you have like a name for this? What do you call this one? Well, it's a superfood oh, cheers. smoothie. Cheers. cheers. And this is strawberry beet. Yum. Mm, this is really good. Delicious, right? So yes. good. Okay. Refreshing. Fantastic. Healthy. You said about 130 calories? 130 calories. That's it. Pretty nice. Okay. And only 12 grams of sugar, by the way. 12 grams of sugar versus of sugar. what you're probably getting if you're dumping sugar in there about in addition to everything. 24, 40. <laughs> some of the smoothie counts are super high. It's a big Watch difference. Watch what you're eating. That's a yeah. big difference. Okay, my eyes are kind of wandering over here just a little bit. Very quickly, walk me through what you have. What you else Okay, you well, Cafe West Express has a whole array of really healthy foods, low sodium, high fiber, nutrient dense. Mm -hmm. And um, we have rumor has it that Buck is a burger fan. <laughs> you think? Rumor has it. Yeah, he's, he's been known to eat a burger. So every now we have and this then. amazing, uh, or it's called Earth Burger at Cafe West Express, and it's delicious. Okay. Quinoa lentil salads, Earth Burger salads. Nice. Just really healthy, easy stuff that tastes absolutely delicious. Sure. Okay. So, so healthy is easy. Yeah, and it can be good. It can be delicious and filling and help you start your day too. Definitely. So, all right. There you go. If you want more information on Cafe West Express or today's smoothie recipe, you can check out the viewer information story on the Fox 5 Atlanta.